tea is deeply ingrained in Chinese history and serves not only as a huge contributor to the economy, but also as a cultural symbol of a community. Ida Waringa takes a close look at the tea industry in Jiangxi province. Tea is an important part of Chinese socialization. It's able to merge a wide variety of differences into a shared sense of identity. It was first discovered in China and is arguably the oldest drink in the world. It has since evolved into an indispensable part of most cultures worldwide. Experts estimate that more than 6 billion people in the world have at some point drank tea or regularly drink it, making it the world's second most consumed beverage. Not only does it contribute significantly to the culture, it does so for the economy as well. And here, in Jiangxi, is where a substantial part of that cash crop is grown, also benefiting the locals. We are relatively busy during the Qingming festival. Just like at the farm, you have a busy season. We have that time crunch. For half a month before the Qingming festival, we come every day. Usually the tea leaves after the Qingming festival are not very good quality. Those will be made into the kind of coarse tea generally used as raw materials, not for drinking. Basically, women who farm at home work here. When I'm not picking tea, I usually stay home and take care of the children. And you usually don't do much at home. According to the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization, China was the world's largest producer of green tea in 2021, having churned out almost half of the world's supply with 3.1 million tons. This has been felt on the grassroots level as well. For example, our tea industry can pay more than 2 million wages a year, and there are more than 2,000 people in our village, and the per capita income increase is about 1,000 yuan. The income for our village collective reached 100,000 yuan. The weather in Jiangxi is also quite conducive for tea growing. And our climate is very suitable for cultivation. We belong to the microclimate. Our tea is mainly sold in Guangdong and Zhejiang, as well as locally here. We have about 1,010 hectares here, and we mainly harvest the tea before the Qingming festival. This year, our tea field produced about 815 kilometers of tea. Tea will undoubtedly always have a special place in China. Ida Warenga, CGTN, Jiangxi.